All right, well, is the Washington Monument sinking? It's a question scientists are trying to answer, and their height survey could have a widespread impact on the district. Greta Cruz is live at the Washington Monument with the details on this tonight. Hi, Greta. Hi, Allison. Well, the short answer is they don't think so, but they are still analyzing the data. They say they will not release that final numbers for another month or two. Now, the National Geodetic Survey took advantage of all the scaffolding that went up there after the earthquake to go to the very, very top. And all week, they've been collecting data. How tall is the Washington Monument? Uh, is it 400 meters? 250 meters? Whoa, it's really tall. <laughs> That's what the National Geodetic Survey is trying to measure. The monument's a very prominent public um, uh, site for people to visit, and they like to know how high it is. But for our purposes, the really important thing is uh, we want to be able to, to determine if there's any changes that have been going on to the monument. In 1934, surveyors actually climbed out a window and from a wooden platform took measurements. During a 1999 facelift, they did it again. We've had GPS on them, and we've had uh, total stations like this one. And this week, a third time. Today, demonstrating high tech equipment that received a laser from the monument top to spit out data. There were concerns after the 2011 earthquake. It did millions in damage and raised fears the monument was sinking or shrinking. After all, the mall itself was built on a swamp. But they concluded last year the height had not changed, still 555 feet, 5 and 1 8 inches tall. And now they want to make sure. What's that like up there? Oh, it's a lovely view and uh, a real thrill and honor. Maintaining accurate measurements also ensures the integrity of flight restrictions and historical records and keeps the tourists happy. Oh, I think it's a good idea. Uh, I'd like this thing to be around for a few hundred more years. Now, scientists have concluded in the past that the Washington Monument has, in fact, shrunk 2.2 inches since 1901. They tell me things like lightning strikes have actually worn the top down. But once again, those final numbers on the new height will not be released for another month or two. The monument, by the way, will, will reopen to the public next spring. On the National Mall, Greta Cruz, ABC 7 News.